Uh, Justin Burdick, do you want to introduce yourself? Where are we going? Hi, uh, yeah, I'm Justin Burdick, and um, we are heading to the Brooks Range in Alaska. Go kill some caribou, have an epic time. Totally stoked. This is the Brooks Range named after. This is um, me. Bradley Brooks's range. That's where we're headed. That's what it should be so, named. Yeah, it should be a good time. Taste of the tundra here, fellas. There he is. There he is. He's up. I'm gonna get a close look at that caribou. We got two grizzlies out in the plain up there. And this walking is absolutely miserable. Mosquitoes are coming out. That's a good sign for today. Uh, she looks hurt. Looks like a cow or a calf. It's not doing so hot. Just judging by the number of brown bears around here. I don't think she's long for this world. So we got two tags left to fill. Two tags filled. Curtis and Jeff both got nice bulls. And now it's just Justin and I they have tags left to fill, and um, this place is unreal. It's really unforgiving too. It's definitely a lot of bears out here, but you know they seem to kind of just mind their own business. Seems like they have better things to do than like look at these gut piles we have laying around, at least so far. But uh, kind of on high alert anytime we go near any of the kill sites that we have so far. So. Awesome trip so far. I'm so fortunate to get to do this with my family and one of my best friends in the whole world. You know, Justin and I have known each other since we were in uh, elementary school, fifth grade, I think is when Justin and I met. So we've known each other a really long time. And we haven't hunted big game together since uh, probably in like 12 or 13 years. So it's a real special trip to be able to spend time up here with such people that know uh, with people that I care about so much. You already see her? Mm-hmm. God damn, the last time I saw her she was going up that way. Over hey there. Bertie, what do we got going on here? This morning. Lots of lots of caribou just a long ways away. What are we gonna do? What's the game plan for the day, you think? I don't know yet, Brad. We got two down, two to fill. You little hesitant to walk two miles across the tundra? Well, two miles. Tundra is like eight miles anywhere else. Yeah. So I have my reservations, yes. <laughs> but I'm willing. Willing, okay, that's good. Good, good. Could it's be nice. a bull, bull of a lifetime over there, though. Yep, could be. <laughs> Curtis, how we doing today? Tired. How's your earlier today, though? It seems like there's more moving around. There's booze, like, in every direction. So we're going to, big wheels on there. Yeah. <laughs> let's see if I can get it in the camera. That butte way off the distance there. Right there, which doesn't look like it's that far. I don't feel like the camera's doing it justice here. Dried blueberries. Fresh blueberries. Cliff bar, my favorite, Ritz peanut butter. Mm, very nice. What's that? Uh, what's that quiver all about? <clears throat> Dang near stepped on it coming across the tundra. 
Somebody's it's been out here before us. Find stuff out here. <laughs> What's that? Somebody else quiver and there's one arrow missing. Yeah, one arrow missing out of the quiver. Can't tell if it's this year. It's got to be this year. I got to think that. But it's aged so much. Look at those veins, like aged and like weathered. I know. It's not like a week's worth of weathering. Oh, if it if it held up over the winter, it it. It would be like a. This could be a commercial for tight spot could be quivers. A tight spot commercial, yeah. <laughs> it can survive. An Arctic. An Arctic winter. <laughs> and probably more than just one. A lot better going up. I'd rather go up <clears throat> than down. I feel like it's this. This is so much easier to walk on these hills so far. Totally. Yeah. Than that awful. It's probably only like a mile and a half, two miles maybe. Good but holy hell, an awful. You know, at home you look up and you go, oh shit, I don't want to go up. Here it's like, give me a hill. I'll take yeah. it. I've tasted the tundra here, fellas. What are you doing, Curtis? Picking blueberries. They're amazing. There's one right there, going across the hill. There's one right there. You see it? Is that him? No. How far away? Like 300. Where are you at? Oh, yeah. We'll chase him, don't worry. Just got up here, sat down. Ridge and think there's a bull caribou right there. We're cruising. It's not huge, but one of us should shoot him. How range him, Curtis? How far is he? Six? He's looking at us. Shh, 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 shh. be quiet. I think he saw us. Well, the good news is I just shot a caribou. Bad news is uh, I had the camera on but forgot to hit record. <laughs> so you just gotta take my word on it that I just shot one. That was crazy. We came up to this high point over here. And uh, we were up there, we just got in there to the spot and I was just taking some video and all of a sudden Justin and Curtis see this caribou running up the hillside above us and uh, it spooked, we jumped it out of its bed so I came charging up and I'm on that hillside over there at that point and I can see it on the rocks over here and it's going side as I was watching it and all of a sudden it just disappears and uh, I waited for Curtis and Justin and I just had a feeling that it was still over here just bedded somewhere and so I just left my stuff over there and said, I'm going by myself, you guys. And I think it's still over there somewhere. Came over here and I'm walking over and sure as hell I look up and there he is. He stood up, he had just rebedded to like hide or something. Thought he was safe. And I just took one shot and dumped him. So I just can't believe that. Yeah, real sorry to you guys out there that you didn't see that, but kill shots aren't that important anyway. I don't know that I could have picked a spot that's like further away from our camp. It's really not ideal at all. I don't think Curtis and Justin are gonna be too thrilled with me. I must ask you a question, Productions. Oh, it's a beautiful thing. That is some beautiful looking dinner right there.
good. So I really wanted Brad to come up here. I pushed him, I was like, dude, you gotta go up there. That's where the bulls are. <laughs> He's like, no, no, I'm just gonna stay down right here. That's where I wanted to go. I was like, no, listen, there's nothing happening. So like, you really need to go up there. Let's go. So I took him and <laughs> this is where we ended up and he killed a really nice bull. I couldn't have done it without you <laughs> pushing me the entire way. I was like, I don't want to go more than 100 yards from camp. And you're like, no, 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 no. That so let's farthest. Just go, let's just go to this knoll, Brad. I'll just take you to this knoll. We'll just stay right there. Yeah. We had a long walk back. I think it's not that bad. <laughs> like, it's kind of what I told you this morning. About when, I, when I look at the camera, I'm like, oh, that's not so bad. Be there in no time. Justin, how are we doing? Ready for chicken fettuccine. What are, what are we doing right now? Taking a little break, bud. A little break. From what? Death hike from hell. Packing out my bowl. Packing out Bradley's bowl. Nice one. It's worth it. I liked it. No regrets at this point? Not yet? No, no regrets. Can't regret the here. Right. Pretty awesome. We said, Brad, we're about done. We're going in deeper. Yeah, about another mile in. And is this all the hummock stuff, or are you on rock? We, by that time, we're on rock. Oh, thank God. Yeah, it's been a long ways away. We're yes. on, that far ridge, on that far ridge, those two rocky points way off in the distance. Rocky are the bottoms point. of your feet sore? Yeah, Brad's gonna massage them tonight. So. Nice. <laughs> he, uh, anyways, we got up in there, and ah. then just we got ready to sit down in glass and looked over, and there was a bowl. Excitement level is quite high right now, waiting for Curtis to catch something here. If any of us are going to catch a fish, it's probably going to be Curtis. Curtis just had a bite. He hit it. I got excited. There you got him. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> 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 Woo! 